Next Level Games. Bom galera e aqui dentro do jogo, antes de irmos para a gameplay, vamos no menu de opções, em options, e aqui vamos na primeira opção, a opção de vídeo. E a primeira opção, é onde podemos alterar a resolução de jogo. Você pode aumentar, para obter o um melhor gráfico, ou diminuir para obter o um melhor desempenho. E abaixo você pode aumentar ou diminuir o brilho do jogo, ou a velocidade do jogo. Bom, entre outras opções que você pode configurar. E depois de configurar, é só aplicar. E confirmar. Pronto, a parte de vídeo já está configurada. Agora vamos configurar os controles de jogo. Vamos voltar no menu de opção, e entrar na segunda opção, selecione o jogador 1, e aqui é só configurar. Lembrando galera que vocês podem jogar de dois jogadores, é só configurar os dois controles. Eu irei configurar o primeiro jogador, e para jogar com o joystick, é só passar os controles. E depois de configurado, é só voltar. Como eu falei, você pode configurar o segundo jogador. Bom, eu irei desativar o segundo jogador, porque irei jogar de um. E agora fiquem com a gameplay. I was sitting here thinking, what a peaceful, dull evening. Then, boom! The nut jobs show up. My old pals, Doc Ock and Green Goblin. Feels like a family reunion. If my family were comprised of lunatics! Venom, my friend, you need to get yourself some breakfast. Got any clever little quips for me, Webhead? Sandman? You're a walking pile of kitty litter. Making fun of you would be too easy. Spidey, hit your ride! Look like you could use a hand. What I can use is a bazooka! <laughs> Sorry, mine's in the shop, but how about this? Pumpkin Bob sure came in handy. What the? Spidey! Friends of yours, Venom? Gross. What the? If this day gets any weirder, I may have to scream. Yep, that'll do it. Yeah! Hello? Nick Fury, director of S.H.I.E.L.D. The anti-terrorist organization? That's just one part of our initiative. The rest is top secret. Your top secret and your headquarters is a giant flying aircraft carrier? You'd be surprised how rarely anybody looks up. You know, I'm happy to be alive and all, but how did I get here? Short-range teleporter pulled you out of the fray. Somebody wake the computer up. It's time to get to work. Mission briefing software online. Welcome, Colonel Fury. Welcome, Spider-Man. Uh, hi? Uh, should I talk to the computer? Only if you want to irritate me. I appreciate the attention. 
Computer, load up the meteor situation report. A while back, a meteor storm passed through our corner of the galaxy. Trajectory Alpha 7-3. Now, most of those space rocks went racing right on by Earth. But one crashed down. Tracking impact locale. Right in the middle of Manhattan. Impact location 40 degrees 47 minutes north, 73 degrees 58 minutes west. Two guesses what hitched a ride on that meteor. Venom. Venom, symbiotic life form of unknown alien origin. But that's not the worst part. It gets worse than Venom? Worse is a relative word. Venom is only a rating 7 of 10 on a scale of terrible ways to die. See, that meteor shower he was part of... As a means of comparison, some selections from level 8 include wasps with laser-guided... Computer, put a sock in it! As I was saying, that meteor shower Venom was part of... One of the meteors went into low Earth orbit and bounced across the atmosphere like a stone on water. But as it went, it broke apart into smaller shards. Meteor shard landing sites. Tokyo, Japan. Tangaroa Island. Cairo, Egypt. Stokerstadt, Transylvania. Annapurna, Nepal. We've tracked the various pieces to their landing sites, but before we could move in to collect them, these nasty pieces of work started showing up. Perpetual holographic avatar, nanotech offensive monster, or phantom. You guys have a department just for acronyms, don't you? Phantoms aren't biological. They're a mix of solid light holographic technology and the symbiote substance found in the meteors. Somebody's making monsters that use the symbiote goo? That's just great. We're clearly dealing with someone of advanced technological means creating these things, and they obviously have their hands. Let me show you around. These are the mission selection terminals. You'll use these to select and start your missions. This is the options terminal, where you can make adjustments to the game settings. This is the roster terminal, where you can select the character that will join you on missions. Up here is the rewards terminal. You can use this terminal to view rewards that you unlock during missions. Over here is the upgrade lab. This is where you can upgrade your web abilities and unlock powerful special attacks for your sidekicks. We're on our way to Tokyo right now. Why don't you take a moment to look around? Computer, show us what we've got on Japan. In Location, Tokyo. Location, Tokyo. Location, Tokyo. I have a very bad feeling. Tap the attack button to strike enemies with punches and kicks. Tokens can be used to upgrade characters and web abilities in the upgrade lab. Tap the grab button to grab enemies and objects. Tap the grab button again to throw a held object. Use attacks to smash containers and find useful items inside. You can grab containers and throw them as ranged weapons. 